Hello guys, my name is Jesper Nissen, and in this video, I'm going to talk to you about a possible replacement for the Twitter moments that I found. So before we get started, let me move myself down here to the left. I want to encourage you to go to my website and sign up for my newsletter because then you will be notified whenever I publish new courses and stuff like that. And I'm actually coming out with two new link building courses in the not so distant future. So sign up and you'll be notified. And another thing is that if you like the video, you think you get anything value out of my video, try or please comment uh, Wakelet as Twitter moment alternative alternative to the video because it will help my channel with engagement. All right. So uh, last year, uh, Twitter, Elon Musk, when uh, he took over Twitter, they shut down the possibility of the option to create Twitter moments. And that was a bit annoying because it was a feature that I used. And you know, it was, it was a feature where we could actually organize all of our tweets and our links and channel authority to our websites through Twitter. But um, so I've been looking for an alternative and I stumbled upon Wakelet last year. And Wakelet is kind of like a social media, not a social media, but it's it's kind of like a bookmarking website, bookmark website or bookmarking platform. Um, and it allows you to uh, collect links and text and content and all sorts of things into a Wakelet. Um, and if you go to wakelet.com and you check out the pricing, you can see that they have a free plan where you can publish up to four collections. A collection is similar to a Twitter moment, but it has a lot more features and I'm going to show you in a minute. And you can also sign up for the individual pro, which is $5.99 per month, and you can do unlimited publishing. So. I mean, it's up to you. Uh, I do have several accounts uh, here with un unlimited publishing because um, because of all the positive features that it, this platform has. And I'm going to show you that in a minute. Just uh, log in here and then uh, you can see what it looks like. Toot. So uh, we have a couple of questions that we need to ans answer with a yes for Wakelet to be identified as a good replacement for Twitter moments. So the first is, can it index? And I have to say, yes, these Wakelets, they do index. And uh, let me show you, a, a Wakelet could look like this. Link building training, best SEO courses on the internet, uh, and then a link to my website. So this, this could be a Wakelet I can then share I could copy the link and I could open it in a browser. And uh, let's see here. It's loading now. So you can see here uh, the meta title is link building training. And this is what it will rank for. Obviously, this wakelet will not rank for link building training because it's not powerful enough. But for long tail keywords, especially in local SEO, it can rank. Uh, right. Let's go back here. So, uh, can it index? Yes. And uh, can it rank? Uh, exactly. That's actually, it can rank. Let me just see here. Can it rank? Yes. Not as good as for the moment. Is it crawled? That's the um, second question we need to uh, ask ourselves. So, is it crawled? Obviously not like Twitter Moments was because Twitter is the kind of like a news channel and it's crawled all the time by Google. And it's not the same with link with the wakelets. So I will say yes, it's crawled, but not as much or not as fast as Twitter Moments. Does it have authority? So when I go to, into my wakelet account and inspect this guy here, link building training, this collection that I made here. And I opened up Mangools up here and I showed data for this specific URL. I can see that it actually has a page authority of 40 and a domain authority of 71. So yes, it contains a lot of authority and it's, I mean, it's a free authority and I love these kinds of links because even though it's, it's only a metric, 
and who knows i mean this this number doesn't come from google it comes from mangools and uh, mangools takes these these two numbers mangools take them from uh, mars so page authority domain authority that's a mars number but still it gives a kind of like a hint that this is actually a quite powerful link so yes a lot can we add links and let me just show you if i go to collections i click create collection here and i can paste in any website address https destination.com so now my website is inserted as a link so this is an outgoing link to yespedition.com. Furthermore, I can also add text here. This is some super text about SEO. And I can add an outgoing link like this. So what I just did here was I added an anchor text link. So this kind of this type of link is kind of like the Holy Grail sounds so stupid, but it's kind of like the Holy Grail in link building. If it was also do follow, that is, uh, because it's anchor text, so it gives it gives Google context about what's going on on the target website. So the target website is yespedition.com, and the anchor text is SEO. So now I'm actually explaining to Google that yespedition.com has something to do with SEO. So let me just close this here. So this is some super text about SEO. So let me reply this with yes. Can we add content? I just showed you, yes. Can we make anchor text links? Yes, we can. So can it be embedded? Because that was a very positive feature with, um, with the Twitter moments was that it could be embedded. And actually inside of this wakelet, we do have this share button up here. And so we can see anybody with the link and code can view. And it, my experience, it, can, it means it can also index, publish to the internet. And I can actually I can copy the link or I can publish and just publish here. And then I can click this, embed this collection. And I then, so this is what it will look like. I then can then grab this, copy this embed code, and I can just insert like this. So this embed code will now, I can now embed this into my cloud site. For example, if I go to X, I can generate a new website. I can say this is about SEO, SEO. Let's just click preview and it will be it will be extremely boring now, but I can go down to contents and uh, SEO here and SEO here and I can then click source Oops. and I can just add this here and click preview and now I uh, now I have embedded this wakelet. So in my opinion, this is an extremely powerful feature uh, for of, of the wakelets that it actually it's actually possible to embed them because then you can actually channel the power through all sorts of manners. So the uh, yes, does it have two followings? So that's the big question, of course. And uh, in the beginning, they actually had do follow links, the, the wakelets, but they changed that. And um, so now they have no follow links. I can just disable my or enable my link checker here. So you can see that this is red. You can also see that this is red. So the links, they are no follow. So that's just a thing to keep in mind that, it, that it's, it's not a do follow link. So it's, this link is not the whole grill. Because the whole grail would be free, has authority, is anchor text, and is do follow. And it can index. It can rank. Super duper holy grail link. Uh, this is not the super duper holy grail because it, uh, it is not a do follow link. But in my testing, I see that no follow links, they also push rank or pass authority. So all is not bad. Um, and the way I use wakelets now is uh, I use them as a part of my um, 
what you would call it, social syndication campaigns. So when we are building cloud stacks, when we are building cloud links for our clients, we collect all of the cloud links into a collection and the YouTube video, if we have created a YouTube video. And so, and then we can take, grab this collection, this wakelet, and then we can embed that in a Google site, for example. And so everything is built together. So in this manner, it doesn't really matter to me if it's a nofollow or dofollow. I know that dofollow links obviously carry the maximum amount of authority, but nofollow, they also work. So that's just a thing to keep in mind. So no. So yeah, that was, uh, that was just it guys. That was uh, the um, topic of this video, the wakelets. I hope you enjoyed it. And in an upcoming video, I'm going to go through my process of how I use wakelets or how I create a wakelet, not how I use a wakelet because I'm making a course about that, but how I create one wakelet. And I'm going to show you uh, what you can do and uh, some stuff that I do um, in order to, you know, enable or in order to use the power from the wakelets and uh, yeah. So keep checking back to my channel for more videos on this topic. Take care, guys.